Chartered Director Programme is a transformational initiative and probably the most important in the IOD's long history because it is designed to convert a membership association into a professional body. And through that commitment to professionalisation, we believe that there are three winners. Firstly, the members who will enjoy enhanced status, the organisation which will benefit from that, and logically, New Zealand Inc. and society. The three key features of the programme are that a new membership structure applies, that members sign up to a charter which has obligations and disclosure requirements, and thirdly, that they undertake continuing professional development. All members will be transitioned into the new category. The majority will notice very little difference. Some members, however, may be transitioned into a higher category of membership, and we aim to have this all completed by the 1st of October this year. This diagram shows where you will be under the new structure and what post-nominal applies. There are criteria that will allow some members to transition into the chartered member category, and these criteria are listed on the website and will be in various forms of documentation that members will receive. Continuing professional development is undertaking education, enhancing one's skills and experience in order to remain current. All professionals need to remain current and competent and undertaking continuing professional development is widely regarded as the best means of achieving that. The shape of our program is very much modelled on that of our trans-Tasman colleagues, the Australian Institute of Company Directors. Our system will be for a three-year rolling period and will require each member to undertake CPD activities that have a points allocation to them and they need to accumulate 60 points over a three-year period. A wide range of learning activities and opportunities will count. They include both formal and informal categories. The important thing about our system is that it's not prescriptive. The individual has the opportunity to determine his or her uh, requirements and then undertake them. And it can be through formal activities, such as formal training, through a range of other activities, including reading, participating in uh, workshops, focus groups, mentoring, and the like. We also recognize that there is huge value to be gained from putting back you know, into the profession. So activities that um, result in um, development of the um, profession of directing and the IOD are also relevant. Naturally, IOD activities will count, but also opportunities offered by third parties will be recognised. All members will receive a guide which indicates the allocation of points to IOD activities and also the criteria for allocating points to third party activities. And we will be leaving that up to the member to determine the value of those third party provisions. All members will be required to record their activities. We are developing an online portal for each member to record their activities online. For the completion of IOD activities, that log will automatically be populated with the points that have been allocated. Members will have to enter third party activities and the points allocated to those. For those who don't want to use the online portal, they will be able to download a hard copy logbook. The Chartered Director Program is seen as a core part of membership, so the administration of that will be at no cost to the member. We believe that the majority of our members are actually already committed to professionalism and are currently undertaking CPD. Given the wide range of activities that qualify, we believe that the majority of our members are probably meeting 
those requirements. There is a cost to professionalism, and that is the need to be current and remain competent. Most professionals accept this. The whole philosophy behind this program is to facilitate members in their personal and professional development. This isn't regarded as being prescriptive, highly onerous, and all the aspects of the program are intended to facilitate um, the members to engage. Commitment to CPD is a hallmark of professionalism. But those who choose not to do it but still want to retain an association with the IOD can do so but as an associate. The IOD is a member organisation. We value our members and want to provide our members with the best membership experience. The quality of our membership determines what we as an organisation can do for them and what we can advocate for in the realm of improving governance across all sections of New Zealand industry and society.